In this video, I want to go over the code words problem, multiples of 3 or 5, 6 KYU. And what it wants us to do is, it's going to pass us a variable called number. And what it wants us to do is iterate from 1 up until that number. And for every number, number divisible by 3 or 5, we're going to sum it up and return it at the end. So they give us an example here. Let me zoom in. So say that the number they give us is 10. What we're going to do is we're going to iterate from 1 to 10 and every number that's divisible by 3 or 5, which is 3, 5, 6, and 9, that is less than 10, we're going to sum them up and return 23 at the end. So 3 plus 5 plus 6 plus 9 is 23. So this uh, isn't too hard either. It's a 6KYU problem. So we're going to start off by creating a variable called sum and initializing it to 0. Reason being is because we are going to use this sum variable to total up the numbers that are divisible by 3 or 5. Next, we need to iterate throughout these numbers. So we're just going to say for i in range, um, we're not going to start at 0. We're going to start from 1 and go up until n minus 1 or number minus 1. Since the range function is non-inclusive, that means that it will not go up until this number. The last iteration will go up until say number is 10 will go up until 9. That's exactly what we want. So for i in range of from 1 to number, well, this is pretty easy. We just check to see, is it divisible by 3 or is it divisible by 5? So if i modulus 3 is equal to 0 or i modulus 5 is equal to 0. If any of these is the case, we're just going to add it to our sum variable. So sum plus equals i. And at the very end of this, once we've iterated throughout uh, every number less than uh, this number variable here, we're just going to return our sum. So what we do is return sum. Let's test it. 11 passed. Let's attempt it. And this should be good. Okay, all 46 passed. So that is the multiples of three or five problems on Code Wars. Um, I hope that you enjoyed it. And if you did, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in future tutorials.